Hello and welcome to the section 5 of the course Hunting Web Shells. Now in this section we are going to take a look at various points. We are going to learn that how you can set up a lab for web shell and what are the tools available for web shell hunting. Web shell hunting overview. Now in this video we are going to take a look at a couple of points. We are going to learn about the basics of web shell and about web shell hunting process. So let's talk about web shell introduction. So here you can see in the figure on the left hand side there is an attacker and attacker is trying to insert a web shell in the website. right? And with the help of that website it is going to store the web shell in the server of the website. It means web server. right? So web shell is a program and with the help of that program attacker can create a backdoor in the web server. So without any username and password authentication attacker can directly grab information from server directly insert into server so that can be done using web shell for it and when we have web shell in the server so it creates a backdoor and then attacker can directly access the server without any authentication now what is web shell hunting so uh, the work of threat hunter to find out the threats inside the server in the scenario you can see and with the help of various shell hunting tools threat hunter is going to find out these bugs and and then threat hunter is going to detect these web shells inside the server so this is the overall overall processes of a shell uploading and shell detection